This is just a brief video to explain why I reverted to Linux kernel 4.15 after installing kernel 4.19 on MX Linux 18. As you can see, I'm still in MX 18, but I'm now using kernel 4.15. Now the reason I reverted is that I encountered a slow but inexorable memory leak in MX 18 using kernel 4.19. It's so slow that I only discovered it after falling asleep with the computer running and YouTube videos playing. When I woke up in the morning, moving the cursor was very sluggish. The whole machine was almost completely blocked up, and I noticed that I was using almost all of my random access memory and about 12% of swap space. So I went back here to the MX package installer and under kernels. As you can see grayed out here is kernel MX 4.15, which is a kernel with the meltdown inspector vulnerabilities patched 64 bits. Now I had loaded the Antix 4.19 kernel and I noticed later that there was an MX 4.19 kernel, but uh, I found that there was no difference that I could tell between the two of them. The first thing I did was to install kernel 4.15 and then to remove kernel 4.19. So now it's running on kernel 4.15 only, and I've had no problem with the memory leak since I made the change. This makes me wonder if under my previous video about the memory differences in Ubuntu Mate 18.10 and MX Linux 17.1, whether the difference might have been in the kernels because Ubuntu Mate 18.10 uses kernel version 4.18. I'm going to look into this further. I'm going to try kernel 4.19 on other distributions to see if there's any difference. I haven't really isolated the problem yet, but I wanted to mention it in case you're interested in trying kernel 4.19 and run into problems. I would suggest exercising caution. This is XRAM Tech. Thanks for watching.